Hi, I'm Joe, aka Breacher from Cobra Airsoft Team, and I'm going to talk a little bit about the kit I run out in the field. Start off on the top, use a basic Viper MTP cap just to stop a bit of ricocheting off the head. I run an M a Viper MTP vest, um, M4 pouches across the board, a couple of pistol pouches, and a chest rig for a Beretta PX4. In the field, I run a Delta Stop Mod. And a little bit of modification, red dot sight on the top, foregrip on the bottom end, tripod on the front and suppressor right out the back. Basically this rifle is absolutely wicked out of the box, it shoots straight as a die, range is absolutely fantastic on it, uh, really good for laying down a bit of cover when you're out in the field, out the way a bit, get out for the guys. Bottom end, I run a drop leg pouch with a spare magazine. Also good for carrying a few grenades, extra rounds, stuff like that. I run standard issue MTP leggings and a nice pair of high-tech Magnum boots. They just work, always have them. I also run a CQB rig, which also looks like this. And this is my black CQB rig, the second rig that I run. Difference with this one, I run a G&G MP5 SD6. Absolutely love this weapon, really fast. Got a blowback on it, gives it a nice little clack, gives it a lot of realism feel. Nice and short, adjustable stock, um, nice for getting up close, round doorways, stuff like that. The rig itself is uh, a one Tigris rig, uh, tactical. The only difference on this one is instead of running the mags on the rig, I run them on a drop leg instead. I also carry four M4 mags for the guys in case they're running low on ammo. I use the same pistol, which is the PX4, running all my rigs. I also run a black drop leg, drop leg bag for any thunder flashes or grenades that we're going to use indoor. Hi, I'm Biff from Bomber, and we're in the shop today and we're going to talk about Joe's kit, what he runs and how he runs it. So I see you've got quite a nice few rifles there. Yeah. So which one do you use all of them in Woodland or do you use one for certain scenarios? Yeah, pretty much a basic setup. Um, I use the SOP mod and my enforcer out in the field. Sock mod's got it a bit of range, um, and force it a little bit more compact, a bit more close up, getting around corners and stuff. And I use the PX4 as my side weapon out in the field. Right. So obviously, I see you've got a nice MTP rig on. Yep. Uh, is there any? Is it in a comfortable position? Would you change anything? Uh, not in this rig. It runs pretty much out of the, out of the packet, basically as it is. Um, got a fair few pouches on it. So plenty of M4 and rounds on it. Nice little pistol ones at the side and pistol up front, pretty much all you need. So uh, I've heard that you've got a black kit as well. I have. And if I do this, whoa, that's cool. Right, so obviously we've gone through a lot of your guns and that. Yep. Now you're in a nice new rig. Yep. Um, tell us a little bit about this one. Okay, this one is me CQB rig. Right. Um, all indoors, runs with the SD6, same sidearm which is the PX4. Um, only little difference on this is I run a drop leg for the MP5 mags. Right. I carry three M4 mags just for backup for the other guys right. in case they run low. I, someone's always carrying ammo for them. That's good. Um, pretty much, that's the only difference. Right. Just that we're in black, obviously blending a little bit more in the dark. Right. The way. Cool. I mean, how did you get into the sport? What was it that drew you towards? Um, <laughs> mine was a friend. Um, right. Literally, we were just looking at pistols, doing a bit of pistol shooting. Um, we've seen, obviously, bomb up at the range and the competitions going on. So we thought, yeah, we'll go down and have a look. Uh, bought a pistol there and then. Um, and then two weeks later, ended up buying a rifle and <laughs> we're hitting the playground and I've been ever since, basically. I mean, are you on any teams at the minute or? Yeah, um, I am part of Cobra Airsoft team, um, AKA Breacher. Um, I was approached by them a couple of weeks ago now at the playground. Um, obviously, people have been speaking and talking and stuff, and they asked if we were to join the team, which was, yeah. Lovely stuff. So, obviously, if there's anything that you think Joe should change about his kit or anything that you'd want to see on your own kit that he has, just give us a comment below and like the video. I've been Biff. And I've been Joe.